What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and today we got the Miami Dolphins coming to town to take on the Arizona Cardinals. Now the Dolphins, they are one of the best teams in the league, especially in the AFC Conference. Now they are battling with the Tennessee Titans for that number one seed. The Titans won today. They are now sitting at 10 and 2. So this is a big game. It's a must game for the Miami Dolphins and we're trying to win game number three. But Ricky Williams is like, take your game number three and get it up out of here. And when I mean three, I mean three in a row. Right now we're sitting at three and eight. We won two games in a row trying to make it three. But again, Ricky Williams, he has plans for six and he has plans on not allowing us to win three games in a row. So McCown going to drop this one off the Griffin. The speedster, 91 speed is a huge upgrade from what we have our running back with our two rookie running backs. We're going to find Casper in the flat, turns upfield, picks up a first down. We are in Miami territory going right up the gut with Molden. He got power though. Now my scouts told me that he ran a 4-4 at the combine, but hey, I don't know why his speed isn't faster than what it is. We go to Anquan Bolden underneath. He gets stopped before he gets to the first down marker, so we settle for the field goal. 7-3 is the score. Our defense forces a 3 and out. McCown looking downfield. Going to find Casper on 4th and 2. Move those chains. First down Cardinals. McCown looking to the flat. It's going to be caught by Molden. Trying to get away from Sertan, but he cannot. And that is going to set up an opportunity for him to run the ball for yet another fresh set of downs. First down and 10. McCown looking for Casper. Touchdown. The friendly ghost strikes again. Now up to this point, Miami has done nothing but run plays. So they hit him with the play fake. And Chambers gets behind everybody. Touch down Dolphins. Check out the replay. The hitters with the play fake. Not only did I bit with Wilson, but my cornerback, Al Harris, he bit too. And that was all she wrote. So what can our offense do? Our offense does nothing. We go three and out. Fielder in the offense for the Miami Dolphins. Back on the field. Chambers makes a man miss. He's able to pick up a gain of 10. But they mark him inches short of the first down marker. They can go with Ricky Williams. Picks up the first down. Mudo Shanks. Toss play to Ricky. Ricky got speed. Ricky got wheels. Ricky got power. And he's going to pick up yet another first down. Third down and 12. Time for the defense to make a play. But nah. Chambers is a man on a mission. He wants that number one seed, y'all. He wants a bye week and two home playoff games if they get that four. Ricky Williams up, up that guy. Doing what he does, man. Still in his prime, it looks like, in this game. So drop at the pass. Note to draw play. And we shut the door. We shut the door. Making them set a full field goal. That's what we want to see. We're down by seven. 10 to 17 is the score. Gonna go to TJ. Who's your mama? First down, Mudo Chains. Second down and seven. Looking to the flat in the five. Molden, another first down. The passing game is working. The running game is working. We got thunder and we got lightning. We doing work, bruh. Second down and 13. Gonna find Casper and we are on the move. We are not bowing down to the much better team. Griffin, he's going to cut this one upfield, picks up a first down. Molded, he's going to rumble, bumble, fight his way forward for a solid game. Now it's going to be third down to go up that gut with Molden, and we got a tie ball game going into halftime. Let's move on to the second half, y'all. Let's do this. McCann looking downfield, has Casper. Casper turns up, he'll use his speed, breaks a tackle, and has another fresh set of downs. McCann over the middle, this time the Anquan Bowden, he turns up, and he picks up a fresh set of downs. So McCann looking downfield, Anquan Bowden, you are a bad man, especially when they try to cover you with the linebacker. Griffin, nothing but speed. Touchdown cars. I said nothing but speed. Touch down card. We're up 24 to 17. Williams up the gut gets brought down after picking up a handful of yards. Fielder looking down. Fielder is going to be caught by Tolliver, and that is going to be yet another first down. Williams to the outside makes one man miss with the stiff arm, but you're not going to get away from everybody. Third down now. Get that thing about here. The defense comes up big. They got to set up for a field goal. The kick is up, and the kick is just inside the right upright and that is going to lead to a 24 to 20 ball game and if our Anquan Bolden hangs on to it on third down another first down give it up the gut with Griffin uses his speed to pick up a nice game third inches we got to get some power in there with Molden gets a nice block to the outside gonna do the rest and picks up a first down and we are now in Miami territory fourth quarter now Griffin up that gut gonna jump over one man and picks up a nice game Anquan Bolden doing his thing one after the catch has is inside the 10. McCown looking. McCown finds and Quan Bolden. Let's go. 
First down and 10, Fielder looking downfield. Gonna find his man, that is Simmons. That's gonna be a first down. There's a minute 38 to go in this one. Who's gonna make a play? Right now, it's nothing but Simmons making plays up and down the field. First down and 10, going to Rookie Williams, gets out of bounds, stops the clock at a buck 15. Even though we have a two possession lead, you gotta admit, this is a little bit nerve wracking. They go to McMichael, first down. Second down and 10, Fielder over the middle to Tolliver, a gain of 15, another first down. Third and 10, 45 seconds to go. Going to the end zone, caught, but they rule it out of bounds. There will be a booth review. They would look at the play. They would review it. I'm nervous. The coach is nervous. Palms are sweaty. Throwing up mom's spaghetti. And they reverse it. They go for two. Ricky Williams out that guy. And now we have a three-point game. But they got to get the onside kick. And get a field goal range. That's too much to handle, isn't it? No, because they recover. So one step is taken care of. Can it take care of another step? Third down and one. 28 seconds to go. Fielder over the middle. Get that thing about it here. Let's go. Fourth down and one. Time to slam the door shut. He breaks a tackle. And Ricky Williams picks up a first down. Second down and 10. Fielder going over the middle. That's going to be caught by Simmons. And Simmons is doing his thing again. Who is this kid? So Mari's going to attempt the 58-yarder. And it is right down Broadway. Simmons got them in field goal position. Knocks home a banger. And it is now 31-31 going into overtime. The Dolphins will win the toss. Ricky Williams is the man on the mission. He smells not only the playoffs, but maybe a Super Bowl berth. Up the guy again. He's going to pick up the first down, but there's a flag on the play. Clipping. Bring it back 14. They're going to give the ball to Williams again. Williams is like this. Ride me, coach. I gotcha. Third down and 16. False start by the center. Third down and 21. We got to get off the field, and we do just that. We have a chance. McCown looking downfield. Going to find McAlley. First catch of the game, move those chains. Mold it. He's going to take this one. Look at the burst. You ain't slow. My mistake. You got some speed, don't you? Right up the guy again with Mold it. And all I got to do is kick a field goal, and this thing is over. The kick is up, and the kick is good. Three in a row. I said three games in a row with dubs, and this was no slouch. This was the Miami Dolphins, nine and two. Top three seed in the AFC after that game. Anyways, man, I don't know how great our chances are making the playoffs, but hey, if we win out, we go 8-8 and we give ourselves a chance. Seattle, they're winning the division. They already got like 10 wins, so we can't catch them. St. Louis, though, has eight wins. We're going to need some hope with that. The Niners are sitting at 4 8. We're 4 8, and we play them next. We got to play them last week. So you know how Madden does. Sometimes the schedule is just bonkers. Anyways, LeVar Fisher, he led the team in tackles. Now, LeVar Fisher actually wore 54 when he was with the Niners. Not the Niners, but the Arizona Cardinals. I checked the uh, 2003 rosters, which would have been the same roster for Madden 04. So we're going to give my man number 45 his real name, which is Jail Hayes, and he actually wore 96. He actually wore 96. LaVar actually wore 54. That's what I saw from a roster from like Fox Sports that was back in 2013. I looked it up today, but yeah. So that, now we're going to give my man his proper number. No no more number 45. He has a name, has his right jersey. We'll take on the Niners. Hope to see you there. Go on for win number four in a row, baby. I'm out. Peace. Hi, Sauce. Check it. Uh. Every day we're getting it. Check it, uh, uh, put the place up, yeah we know what we made of, can't get enough of you boo, I'm a chaser, face up, 